Hey guys, it's me, Vic 23 and welcome to Polybridge, a really cool, cartoony, structural engineering, bridge building game type thing that I'm going to jump straight into right here and uh, be starting from the beginning and uh, I'm just going to try it out. And if you guys enjoy this and like to see this become a series on the channel, leave a like rating and let me know down below. I love games like this, so there's a good chance there will be more episodes, but uh, I'm going through... Uh, I've done actually this tutorial level before, um, but I'm just doing it again just so you guys can have kind of a rough idea of how how the game goes. So pretty much, you have to build bridges for cars to to get over. I mean, that's that would make sense, right? It's called Poly Bridge, and uh, it, it can get it does get kind of really really complicated, really really challenging. Obviously, when it comes to designing anything, triangles are the key. I'm probably going a bit overboard on this, but I don't want to fail my first bridge. You press spacebar and you see if the car can make it across and no trouble at all right there. So there we go. First level complete. Next level, what do we have this time? Okay, we have two cars. We have something a little different right here. So road. So let's just add in a flat road straight across the top. And oh. No, stop cars. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> let's try that again. Um, just road on its own isn't strong enough. So let's grab some wood. And from here... Probably the best thing to do is actually to have it kind of, um, I mean, we could go for anything, but honestly, the strongest is probably going to be to have it actually extend. The thing is, if I have it extend to there, it can't actually reach there, so what I can do is I can hold, sh oh wait, nope, that's how I tab out of the game. I can hold shift and move that. You know, let's just go straight up the middle. Like, that's, that's what I'm, I'm being tempted to do, and actually, if we still stick with the triangles, we get that, if we connect that there, that should be fine. And go for the same here. I mean, I'm not sure this is going to be symmetrical. I'm going to try and make everything symmetrical. Actually, also, what I should do is I should probably connect these edge ones. Because the red ones are the fixed in place ones. Um, yeah, I don't want to make split joints. Yeah, the red ones are the fixed in place ones. So if you put all the pressure on one of the red ones, it's not going to go that well. That's not at all symmetrical. But it should hold fairly strong. So there we go. I'm breezing through the easy levels. But this gets very difficult very quickly. So I'm just trying to rush through these... Um, this series, I guess, hopefully will replace uh, Seven Days to Die on this channel, which that's a series I, uh, I'm going to be doing co-op on my Vicstar Plays channel as soon as I can get that all set up. Obviously, I'm not at home at the moment. So here we have like a rock with two structural fingers on it. So here, I like the idea of just going for something a bit like that. And I should keep it on the budget, so okay. I'm doing okay on the budget. I've just got to be wary, actually. Once I've got to half the budget, that's when I need to watch out. Let's uh, let's move that to there. Oh, I see. It has to be above water level. Gotcha. So, have something like this. Then, the triangle here. I'm not trying to make split things. See, I'm worried. Actually, not. Actually, the road took a lot of the budget, so I should be fine. Continuing with this design. How does it even go? Symmetry is the key There we go, and then we have this go from there to there We may as well turn these diamonds into triangles and honestly. Oh Let's uh, so yeah, I can stretch that a bit I can stretch that a bit um, Let's um, Let's delete that Let's see Can I can I delete? Oh wait, I need to select you like that and delete you now, <laughs> we're so close. <laughs> they just want to be together. You know what, I'm going to just leave it. Is that going to be the downfall of my bridge? Oh, so the light car made it over the heavy? No trouble at all. What was I worrying about? What was I worrying about? So far, so do you get, I guess you get points for that. Um, for not using the budget. Okay, here we go. 10 meter jump. So road going straight across the top. You can't create any more road. Hold on. Oh, okay. So he has to jump this, I guess. I see. Okay. So let's uh, let's do undo that. I guess realistically we want something like that and something like that. And I just need to make that stay where it is. So already we have a different style going on. And that, just a straight, straight. This should work. A straight. This should work. Yeah. Whoa. All right. Please don't die, my friend. I hope that's not too steep. Okay, I think that was a bit too steep. 
So what we can do is we can just stretch that down a bit. Probably there would make sense. And there, because they can go a tiny bit further out. Okay. Are you going to live today? Oh, wait. Uh, of course. That doesn't have to be angled at all. Okay, here we go. He's going to make it now. I hope he's good at making landings. Ah, nailed it. Of course. What was I doing? I had such a stereotypical, you know, when they have the stunt cars that jump over trucks and stuff. It's a ramp on both sides. I guess, like, in real world physics, that would make sense. In the sense... That would make sense in the sense that something or other, I don't know, I was... Words. Okay, so how are we going to make this? So we have the two fixed points. We just use a bit of wood. And we kind of create... Probably an, a suspension bridge underneath. So we have these alternating along the way. I know that's really neat. Un, unneat, really neat, really unneat. If we do that, that should work. Because that's all connected as one. He says. Alright, we're not really struggling yet, but these bridges do get crazy, believe me. It's so fun though. I, I like it's, it's it's addictive. It's addictive. It's just and it's laid back. A lot of games are, you know, super like hardcore. Whereas this is very very laid back. I can just kind of chill out, build my stuff. I actually used to play a game like this a long time ago. It's actually called I'm pretty sure it was called like Bridge Simulator. I think 2004, I'm not even kidding. Like does that make me old yet? I mean, I'm not, not really. So easy suspension bridge there. We've got tons of budget in here. Let's just... Uh, let's honestly, let's straight connect that up. And let's straight connect this up. And then we'll work out the rest of the structure from... Oh, you know, that needs to go there. Then... Can I move that to... Oh, that is so obnoxious. That is that is irritating. You know, what, let's just let's just let's do it from this side then. Do it from this side. And there we go, no trouble that way. Now, if I just kind of create. Oh, this will actually be strong as anything. You know, I actually have to move that to one side. Um. Let's just, let's just connect this all up. How much um, See, we made a square there. That's not very good. Thing is, we've got, like, even more budget. We might as well just make this whole thing. Look at this. Look at this go. Can we move that down? Surely we should be able to. I guess that one's at maximum. Honestly, we can just put another point to there. Let's just make a mad, mad intersection. Look, we still have budget. That's going to be more than fine. Famous last words, eh? That's going to be more than fine. I need to uh, bring all of these together if I can. This is deceptive. It's actually deceptive because it makes you think that you're going to be okay when you're not. I mean, I wouldn't say that's that deceptive. Oh, it's just annoying little bits like that. Because that's not going to help. Honestly, you know what? If all else fails, just add a ton of those. This is all a bit of a mess, to be honest. I've, I've, I should have designed that from the bottom up. It's not going to do it. I should have designed that from because all of those sections that are open. I should probably just shut up, shouldn't I? Should we, should we do the no commentary? Should we do the no commentary um, poly bridge? All right, on this level, we have a boat that needs to get through. So we're going to have to go over that. We don't actually have hydraulic pieces yet. You can use those usually for uh, for making kind of bridge openings, but we don't have those on our side. So, you know, let's, uh, let's have this kind of... It's going to be quite close, but I want to keep the main design of it quite flat and... I'm starting to wonder, actually, now, you know, actually, forget that whole idea. Come on. Use a curve. Let's make it arch. Arch very gently over there. Um, so, actually, it needs to start steeper. And it will be more secure for starting steeper. There we go. And now, honestly, we can just aim straight for there. It's not giving me the nice curve I was looking for. But if I structurize, structurize. New word. It's like accessorize, but instead structurize. If I structurize this correctly, 
we could be in business. Now, one thing I'm going to do straight away is link this to that and uh, get some nice triangulation going on. That, oh, you know, I'm going to move that down one. Can I? Oh, no, because that's, that's all kind of at maximum stretch. That's the worry. That's fine by me. Okay. So we want to have this section of the bridge supported like that. And we can get a nice little triangular thing going on in here. Use a lot of our budget. And this section will be really tough. And that should all work out with that. Now, this is where it gets slightly dodgy. What can I do here with this? Because I always need to connect this to something. Hmm. Oh, I do worry now. Oh, I worry about everything I've done up to this point. Will this even hold? I don't think it will even... Oh, the boat doesn't... <laughs> okay, so we need to move this up a bit. Move that out a bit. Does the boat make it through? That's the first bit. Okay, boat makes it through. Thing is, this looks so weak there. But it kind of... <laughs> I was about to speak too soon. Okay, so what we can actually do is we can... Sorry, we can... We can kind of have this all... Hopefully, structurally supporting itself. Can I double this up? Or does that not really do anything? I'm not sure it actually does anything. You know, actually, I've already seen. Let's see if... It like has like a cool wave function to it, the boat gets under. Oh, I should, I could probably do some more support there, I'd say. Although, it's bouncing! But we are through, okay, we had our teething issues with that one. That, that was a big step up from the last view, working that one out. Okay, scooter and car city. So, we have a car and we have a scooter, makes sense. And we have, how much road do we have? We have, ah, we have five pieces, so. I should probably make that them jump kind of there and then try and catch them along here. That's what I'm thinking would kind of work out here, I hope. All right, so now we go on to the wood. We just need to stay in budget right here. So I want to secure all of this together. So I think it's going to make sense to get something like that going on. Link all of you together. I've created a bit of a diamond there, but I should be able to keep that all together and hopefully that'll be quite secure. Ah, even better, even better right there. Now, I mean, let's see if they launch off. Like, that's just gonna flop. They're gonna drown. I'm sorry, I didn't want you to... To be fair, they made quality distance. I'm actually, I'm feeling good about this. If I can just secure this up, which hopefully I've done there. You know, even, look, we're below budget by a fair bit. We can even add some extra structure there. I think, I think they made it. I mean, I hope. Oh, <laughs> mate, like, no, is, is this actually, this, that would happen. The car became a turtus. He was like, you know what, they said I could be a turtle. You know, honestly, they were easily making the distance, so let's angle them a bit less. And there we go, they're driving on happy and fine. All right, what next? Oh, okay, 60 meter overpass. Oh, we've got steel now, so we've got a large pedal bit coming in, and we've not got the drawbridge piece yet, but we've got the steel, okay. And it has to be a suspension bridge. It has to hold itself up. There's nothing in the middle to hold it. So let's start with the road, actually. So the road is going to just go over and over and over. As you might expect. That's actually worked out pretty symmetrically. Um, you know, let's have that there. Pretty symmetrically. And, oh, wait. No, we need to. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty symmetrically and pretty curvically. Curvically is now a word. Let's uh, have it all just... Go a little nicer here. I almost feel like we could make that. It's like every, you know, it's just, it's almost like, I want to say that's like, it's an, obviously I don't have OCD. People get like, that's one thing on the internet. If you say you have OCD and you don't, people get, people with OCD, they get really bothered by it, which actually is kind of understandable. But hey, so we've got this steel. So we have these points either side. So I guess we could create something like this. And then we want to, we want a cable. Do we, wait, do they give us cables? Oh no, we don't have cables. And so that means, to, and we've got three, so we could go for something like that. But the thing is, the only thing we have left to hook it together is wood. Which actually suggests to me we want to change this up a lot and have it much lower. 
something like that. Um, something like that to there, I'd say. Let's go for a similar thing over here. I know it's not technically accurate. And now if I just get a load of wood to support all of this together. Ah, this, this all looks nice, doesn't it? Look at this go. There we go. That gets a little bit messy. We can put in our own little artificial thing there, which actually will link nice. We can do the same. Probably not going to manage the same here. Let's see. Oh, it shows you when, you when you're about to click where it will link to. So there we go. That's actually super useful to know that. Honestly, ah, oh, damn it. Um, honestly, I say honestly way too much. Oh, we could be in a bit of a situation now. But it's fine, we can just add in more triangles. Like, if all else fails, just add in more triangles. It's like, it's a simple principle that the Illuminati began. Okay, this bridge looks wonky as anything, but with the way the tension is, like, if we go on stress, it's doing really well, so you can see there's a weak point there. I've not actually been using this, but we've had easy bridges, so nailed it. Boat comes through, imagine that just annihilates it. Oh wait, the other car's gotta come through. Ah, did I celebrate too soon? Did I celebrate? No, he's coming th Oh, that was close to breaking, but there we go. All right, we're bridging. We are bridging, you know, all of our troubles, like in the water down below, we just bring through. Ooh, now we get through a drawbridge. I think this is gonna be the final one I do today. Now we have a hydraulic phase, so. We have six road, and I'm assuming, yeah, there's going to be one right in the middle that works perfectly. And then we just want to, actually, we want to, how do we do this? So we go on hydraulic, and I just add it. How do I, oh wait, do, how do I do this? I think I do it like that and like that. And then, there we go. We've got a split joint there, so that can rise up and down. Now I need to make sure the rest of the bridge is supported. And we just have wood for this, but it's fine. I think that would be acceptable. Ha 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 ha. So we can't actually go near that middle section. Because we have the boat there. So I believe the rest of the structure or support is going to have to go over the top. And we'll create our own kind of arc. Arc or arch? Our own arch. Right here. So. Goes like this. There we go. That might even work like that, but honestly, what I'm gonna do anyway, pull that one over. We can even add our own, even add our own triangles. Look, we've got plenty of budget. I think we're gonna be well short of the budget here, and I think that should hold. No, we don't want to make that a split joint. I think this is gonna hold. I hope. Yes. Ah. So it turns out I hadn't actually put any hydraulics in. They work like this. They'll pull a bridge to where it makes sense for it to be. That looks a lot more like hydraulics. So I raised my bridge up a little bit, added those on, and now it can pull that safely out of the way for when the boat comes through. Yes, we are all good. And then it's going to drop it back down. And our little car, other car, sh actually, will it be able to drive through? I actually made it quite weak at the top here. Look, I'm well under the budget. Is that going to cost me? It's not, actually. So we've done that with, like, 9,000 less budget. Okay, so there we go. We've handled hydraulics. We've handled steel. All sorts of cool stuff. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this episode of Polybridge. There is most likely going to be another episode. I've had a ton of fun. So if you guys have enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like. And uh, I will see you all on the next episode. Thanks, and goodbye.